Alrighty guys, so what we're going to do is integrate GetResponse, which is the email autoresponder that I use um, with Shopify. So the link is to, to GetResponse is down below. So just go and join that 30 day free trial. So you can't go wrong with that. So all you're gonna do is come to your Shopify store, go to the app store. I've already installed it because it's just makes the video quicker. Um, and then you're gonna go to yeah, go to the, you'll arrive on the app store, then you'll just search get response. And then you will obviously find it here. And then you just click. Then you just click get it's $5 a month. But as we've talked about, if you're making 30 40% of your money from your email campaigns, $5 a month really isn't much money to pay to be you know, making so much money on the back end. So definitely worth it. So take that $5 a month that works out to almost nothing per day. So then what we do is, um, so it's installed and then you just click on it and then you come to here. So it's going to say export existing data. Uh, you will go yes. And the other thing that you will do. So inside your get response, um, as I said, click the link down below to, uh, or wherever I have it to get this, um, you're going to go integrations and API, and then you're going to go to Shopify. So Shopify, you're going to connect to Shopify. So you're going to put your URL in there. So if we just go to the online store, And then we go back into your shop URL, connect to Shopify, just like that. Okay, I don't know why that's doing that. But anyway, let's go back here for a second. My internet's really slow at the moment, so it's been quite annoying, um, which is why I installed the app instead of doing it while the video is live thinking that it'll save some headaches. Um, uh, what have we got here? Only applies to the blah, blah, blah. Theme only supports a MailChimp integration. You can paste this URL in the MailChimp. The themes for that. No. To prevent abuse also know that the mail form can only be tested after you've finished installing the integration we'll just go proceed connect your get response account so we need to get the api key from um, get response so maybe i was doing this wrong anyway if i just go back <clears throat> to get the API key, we're going to go to integrations and API. Did I just click on that? Or are we already in? We're already in it. Okay. API is right here. And then this is the API key. So we'll just copy that and go back to here. Paste it test and save connection successful guys all right um please enter your email address so we can keep you informed about this integration finish install The installation has succeeded. You are now redirected to your get response account. So there you go, guys, that uh, obviously this is popping up again, because I'm just having problems with my internet connection. But as you saw, it was all successful. And now you guys know how to do it. And that is about it.